Dan Perry here in our continuing series on TCPIP basics. Uh, part 8 is a continuation of our intro to IP4 addresses. We're going to be talking about classes. We're going to continue discussing our classful addressing schemes. Now, class A addresses, as we saw last time, are designed for the larger networks. The first eight bits of a net of the uh, IP address represent the network number, and the remaining 24 bits are the host. Uh, the number of bits in the host portion, as we said before, determines the number of machines or devices or hosts that can be on a network. Uh, the generic term host comes from the Unix environment. Uh, most people think of those as computers, but they can be routers, switches, or other devices as long as they have an IP address. Um, basically now all of your IP addresses, or Class A IP addresses, have been assigned. Now, if you see an IP address that is um, starts with the number 10, for example, that's a Class A, and as we see in this diagram, the first octet, the green number, that's the network, and that gives us the uh, remaining 24 bits for the host portion. <clears throat> now, class B addresses, we basically split down the middle. The first 16 bits are the network number, the remaining 16 bits are for the host. Uh, they are traditionally assigned to medium-sized businesses, maybe larger universities, um, smaller ISPs. And we see here the network portion is the first half, in this case 172.20, and the last 16 bits are assigned for the host. And then Class C addresses we use the first 24 bits of the address for the network with 8 bit bits for the host. Uh, small size businesses uh, are typically issued those. I believe I said in the previous um, video that uh, the school where I work, we have 8 Class C addresses issued to us, giving us 2,048 total IP addresses. There are more Class C networks than any other type due to the small nature of it. They're more plentiful. Um, there are 256 IP addresses per network. Uh, here we see an example of uh, 192.168.32. The first three octets or first 24 bits for the network portion with the last eight bits reserved for the host. Now, when we talk about numbering of bits, we'll talk about a specific bit in uh, future episodes. And when we do, uh, we want to start numbering our bits at the left, and we start numbering at zero. So the leftmost bit is bit zero, the rightmost bit is bit 31, and... For example, the, I'm showing bit 15. That is the last bit of the second octet. It's the 16th bit, or, or if we counted from 1, it's 16 bits over. Since we count from 0, it would be bit 15. Now, next time we're going to look at some of the uh, reserved addresses that are used in TCPIP and what they're used for. <clears throat>